Hi guys, my name is Axel Mulat and now my website is up and running in the internet. Let's continue the development of this WordPress self-hosted site. Let's go to admin side and let's edit the profile. Go to user and profile. In this profile section in the admin area, you can change the admin color scheme if you like from the default color which is this black let's change the admin color scheme to blue and as you see the color has changed in the panel coffee midnight and i like the default let's back to the default color if you want to hide this this toolbar when you visit the admin site this toolbar will show up if you log in in your wordpress admin let's uncheck this update profile and reload and as you see the toolbar has disappeared if you want to back the toolbar, just go to the profile and check it back and save. And let's scroll down your username, first name, of course, let's fill this in. Last name and nickname and display name as public, publicly as. And your email, of course. And website let's fill this up you move and also about yourself biographical info I have one hi I'm Axel Mulat web developer and so on and profile picture this profile picture in the WordPress admin area will display if you register in grabatar.com Grabatar and WordPress are same company, automatic. This, as you see of the top left in the bar, that is the image, a tiny image, that is a Grabatar. And this is the Grabatar. Let's click this. Register in Grabatar.com. Click this sign in button. If you click that, there have a sign up button behind this page. When you register in Grabatar.com, just upload your profile image and be sure your email address is the same in your WordPress self-hosted site. This is email. Use this email when you sign up in Grabatar.com and after you successfully sign up in Grabatar.com, your Grabatar image will be displayed in the admin area in your WordPress site. Okay, and also guys, use the very, very strong password to secure your WordPress admin. Generate password and copy this somewhere in your computer or take a note on this and update profile. Update profile. And let's see the biographical info in the admin. By the way, guys, Biographical info depending of your team support. Other teams has not supported for biographical info. Let's go to the post. Let's see the biographical info. Display that in the bottom of the article or post. And see guys, this team is not supported for biographical info. There have a team supported for biographical info the 2015 team let's switch to 2015 team 15 activate we will back guys this team let's see the biographical info of this team activate reload this page scroll down and as you see guys this is the biographical info this team has supported for biographical info but this 2017 team is not 
let's back activate if in case guys if your team choose is not supported for biographical info or author box you can extend your team with this plugin extend the functionality for author box or biographical info let's go to the plugin section and add new plugin and let's search author box And as you see, guys, there have a bunch of results about Autobox plugin. Just choose here with your choice and install and activate. Once you activate and install and configure this plugin, the Autobox will be shown underneath the post section. I like this plugin, which I use to my website, axelmulat.com. Let's click this, more details, and let's see the screenshot, screenshot. And as you see, this is looks like just install this plugin, guys. If you want to show the author box in the post section. And lastly, guys, if you want to add a new admin in your WordPress website, just add new user, add new user, and fill up this form, username, email, and website, and strong password, and select a role for a new user admin. The super user is administrator. The editor role is that this editor can be add a post and edit only, and add new user. And that's all for this video, guys. In the next video, we will manage our comments and spam comments. See you next video. Bye.